Hey guys, so in this video, we're gonna be cleaning the baby iguana tank and we're gonna be checking them out. There's been a lot of requests for this video on an update, so I hope you guys enjoy. Hit that like and hit that subscribe button. I figure exercise is very important to them. So while I'm cleaning the tank, I figured they might as well go for a little pool time. Hey, it's summertime. Hey, Geico, are you okay? Hey, Spyro. Oh, look at Spyro. Spyro's an excellent swimmer. Hey, Godzilla. This is baby Godzilla right here. Here goes baby Godzilla. Go in there, show everybody how you swim. We're Spyro. This is Spyro. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you guys are having fun They're today. so adorable. I'm such a proud parent. Oh yeah. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. It's okay, it's okay. You guys have fun. It's pool time. And after that everybody, we're gonna have lunch. So I hope everybody builds an appetite. Hey Spyro, how are you? You wanna jump in? Go, go, go. Yeah. You tired? Them boys have been eating exclusively of romaine lettuce mangoes and watermelon and they've been loving it because they've been eating really fat now i want to feed them just an appropriate amount i don't want to overfeed them because the more you feed them the more bigger they're going to grow quicker so i feel like half a cup of lettuce a day is straight um I wouldn't want to like, you know, give them as much food as possible because they're gonna outgrow their tank. And, uh, you know, I need to keep them small for a little bit longer. Their tank, but we do have seven of them. And if anybody's interested in adopting a baby iguana that lives in South Florida, please leave a comment and we'll get some arrangements. But here they are right here. They're just, they just enjoyed their bath. Gonna give them some fresh lettuce to eat. There they go. We'll put them in the sun for a little bit as well. Oh, there you guys go. I've put some apples in there. They really, really love the romaine lettuce though. And I've actually seen them eating it. And it's so cute because they get it. And they actually head shake. They head shake when they're eating it. It's like the most funniest little thing. They look like little, look like little dinosaurs trying to feast. You know, but here they are. They just got their bath. So they're about to get a little bit of sun. And um, they got some food right there and some water. So they've been doing really well. Like I mentioned, if anybody at home wants to adopt one, adopt one, please leave a comment. We'll make some arrangements possible. Please be advised, if you're considering adopting a green iguana, they do grow from anywhere from three feet to six feet. So it's for an experienced pet owner with a nice big enclosure. Responsibility is a must and knowing what you're getting into is very important. Cause like I said, these things will grow big and it's your job to tame them when they're young so they are not aggressive. If you leave them as is, they're gonna be wild, aggressive, biting and scratching. So appreciate you guys watching this video. Hit the like, leave a comment, of course subscribe and tell a friend, and until next time guys, just keep on catching.